Hi, my friends. I hope you guys are doing well. I promised that I would share my latest um, archives pieces from Cezanne. And here I am. It's just four pieces, so it's going to be a really short video. The first one is actually this Kara shirt, which I really love. Um, and I have a video about archives if you want to score new pieces. Whenever they have the new archives, please watch this video because it's going to help you a lot. So before I show you this, I want to thank Madame Glam for gifting me this beautiful nail polish, the gel polish. I actually reviewed uh, some of them for you before. And by the way, you can check their website. I put in the description box below and it would take you straight to the website and give you 30% off your purchase. So you don't have to do anything, just click on the link and you already get the 30% off immediately on your purchase. So it's a really, really good deal. I had those colors before and they just sent me a few more, four more actually, which are these. I picked them, of course. The first one is called Brave Heart, which is the one I am wearing today, which is so beautiful. I think it's a beautiful nude and just perfect for an everyday um, wear. It also gave me Brave Heart, which I chose. I think this is a gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous kind of gray. It's a bit, bit of a taupe, purplish gray. I love, I use this on my feet. And I also chose a color um, Ballerina, which is a very nice nude, but almost like a super light pink in between white and pink a crew, which I think is gorgeous. And for fun, I got this one called Green Energy, which is so beautiful. I have never wor worn anything like this, I think. I do not have any nail polish that looks like this, so I'm very excited to try these. Those are super easy to use. You just have to use your base coat, which also came in the box, and then you just make sure you apply a very thin layer, otherwise it might be too bulky and hard to cure with the LED light. And once you do this, you cure in the LED light and then you use the polish. You can just use one um, layer because it hovers really well, so you don't really need a second layer. But if you feel like you need, just use a second layer and then you cure. And then you finish with your top coat. They have everything. This is so easy also when it comes off, like if you want to take it off, you don't need the nail polish remover. You can just peel it off and it's just super, super easy. So. This has saved me money and it has saved me so much time because I don't have to go to the salon. I can just do it myself and it just made my life so much easier. And I love to have, you know, nice nails whenever I don't have a good makeup or when I don't have like great clothes on. I just feel like it's a special touch that makes you feel more taken care of. So don't forget to click on the description be uh, box below so you can check the link and you will get 30% off your purchase. It's a really, really good deal. So starting with our video, this is the Kara shirt and I love this shirt. You can see it's very sheer when it comes to the eyelet because this, they, this is really big, like the <laughs> opening is pretty big, but you can easily just wear a nude bra or a little top underneath and it's going to be fine. I think that's the idea. I got this one in my usual size, which is 36 or 4 US, and I got that in actually both colors. If I'm not wrong, the white is still available, so definitely check that out. Those are really beautiful pieces. They have similar ones now with the new collection, but if you can get these with a nice discount, I would say why not? I think it's really, really pretty. I love how the sleeves are. I think for some people that might make their shoulders a little bit too broad and too bulky, but I just like it on me. I don't feel like it's too much. You can easily button all the way up, but for me, I just feel like it looks nicer when I um, open a bit. The sleeves are good, I would say a tiny bit um, short, so if you're on the petite side, that's good for you, but if you're taller, I think that might be a problem. You would just probably need to pull up the sleeves or do something like that, unless you don't really mind, because I know some people prefer to have a shorter sleeve so they can layer, you know, their jewelry, etc. Oh, talking about jewelry, I'm wearing this gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous ring. I wanted to show you guys, this is not sponsored. I actually bought with my own money, but it's from a brand that I have worked before. So I have a discount code. And I also got the earring, which is so, so beautiful. Oh my God. Like the pictures don't do justice to it. It's just such a gorgeous, gorgeous piece. 
and I'm going to be sharing very soon with you some of my jewelry like my favorite jewelry pieces I just think like jewelry really spices up any outfit so back to our season um, stuff these are really nice and I love them I'm trying to decide which one I'm keeping I think I'm gonna keep this because it's just so much easier to find a white shirt and this color just felt more unique to me now the next piece is the Curtis um, jumper which is very different from the website like this stock photo I feel like this on the website was definitely more of a terracotta um, kind of red but in real life it's definitely more of a berry color like a magenta mixed with a little bit of you know pink purple red burgundy it's all together but definitely very saturated this one runs small i don't think it's available i got this one in extra small because they didn't have the small which is my usual size and i do feel like it's a little bit too tight on me i would definitely have more benefits with the small one because i think it would fit me better this is 100 percent cashmere so a good purchase if you have a chance to do um, it's not available anymore because it's from the archives, but maybe from restocks or on the pre-loved market. I buy a lot from Poshmark, eBay, um, not Vinted, I haven't yet, Vestiaire Collective. So there are some ways, um, the real real, there are some ways to find those pieces for a very good price, similar to archives, if you are looking for them. And that's why I'm sharing them, because even though they're not available on the website, you can still have a chance to get them. So I really love the quality. I love the color. It was a surprise, but I think it's really beautiful. But the size, unfortunately, wasn't quite um, good for me. So this one I am returning. In the last piece is the Tammy skirt, which I have reviewed before. I have one Tammy skirt that I own actually, and I have tried a few more in different prints. You can, you guys can see my old videos. So this one is in this beautiful blue, but unfortunately the color is not great for me, as you can see. <laughs> it really isn't for me and I'm gonna be doing my color analysis very soon and I will definitely share with you guys I think it's so fun and even though you always know like which colors work best for you it would be so nice to have myself like analyzed by a professional you know I think it's a very exciting thing and I, I can't wait to do it so the Tammy skirt definitely runs small at least all the ones that I tried I'm always in between 4 and 6 or 36 38 and this one I got in 30H because the 36 was just too, too tight on my hips. I have all my measurements below if you guys want to see, but just so you know, I have about 40, 41 inches for hips. So the 38 was the best for me. I think it's a great skirt. I love how flowy it is. Um, it, it is lined, so definitely a good thing because this fabric is very sheer, but it doesn't show anything because of the lining. So it's a great piece. If you have a chance to get and you like the color, I would highly recommend. Uh, great for fall, for spring, for summer. I think it's a beautiful skirt. And I just wish the color had worked better for me. When I saw on the website, I thought I had an impression it would be a little bit warmer, but I feel like this is very, very cool tone for me and I just don't like it, <laughs> at least not on me. So those are the pieces that I got. I hope you guys enjoyed and i'll be back very soon with more videos like i said last week let me know what you'd like to see i am definitely working on my knitwear collection i told you in my latest video that i had such a hard time because our bed broke and then um i had to redo everything like my house was a mess for such a long time and i'm finally starting to see everything in place again so I'm working on that and I'm definitely going to share as soon as possible as well as the color analysis. I haven't done yet, but I am looking for the right person to do. And as soon as I do, I will share with you because I know everyone is curious. I've heard so much like, you're summer, you're winter, you're autumn. <laughs> I don't know what I am. Um, I believe I am autumn. I think I am an autumn, but I'm not completely sure. And I'm saying that because I feel like more of a warm tone, undertone, at least when I check my veins. And for the jewelry when I wear, I just feel like some of the cool tone um, colors, they just really clash on me and they do not make me look great, especially if I wear gray or like pastel, like pink or um, like a light blue, it just doesn't work very well. I'm definitely more towards a deep colors like this one, I think looks great. I think burgundy, olive, um, navy, well, navy is a color that works for pretty much everybody, right? 
everybody will look great with the with navy so um i'm just very curious to see so um yeah just let me know what you think what's your batch do you think i'm an autumn do you think i'm a summer do you think i'm a winter definitely not spring but maybe you would think i'm a spring um and if you have done your color analysis i would love to hear from you like if you have any recommendation we'd love to know thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time bye